How's it going everyone and welcome to another episode of modded Stardew Valley. So last episode is being reloaded and I apologize about that. It was pretty bad. I was at work so I couldn't do it earlier than I wanted to. Thank you for the uh, person who let me know. I really appreciate that. Um, it will be re-uploaded. So again, apologies. I didn't want to have a horrible video like that out. It was pretty bad. So let's begin. Welcome to Kozu 5, your number one source for weather news and entertainment. And now, the weather forecast for tomorrow. It's going to be clear and sunny tomorrow. Perfect weather for the Festival of, Festival of Ice. The event will take place in the forest, starting between 9 a.m. and 2 p.m. Don't be late. Ooh, I see a glimmer within my scrying orb. A shard of knowledge from the future. Spirits are in good humor today. I think I'll have a little extra luck. And... Greetings, it is I, the Queen of Sauce, here to teach you a new mouthwatering recipe from my secret cookbook. This week's dish, poppy seed muffin. Poppies make beautiful ornamental flowers, but why not make full use of the plant with these delightful muffins? I'm a huge fan of poppy seeds. They're subtle, subtle but they add a nice flavor and a great texture to bready desserts, and they're healthy. Nice. All right, a new recipe. That's awesome. Are you going to, the, are you going to enter the fishing contest tomorrow? I sure am. I'm going to win it. All right. So, I installed a new mod. I know, uh, errors, blah, blah, blah. I'm hoping nothing goes wrong. If it does, I'll redo the episode. But, yeah. I'm sorry for visiting so early, Kingler. But I did promise that I'll notify you when the hotel expansion is complete. I'm glad you seem delighted. Richard has also partnered with Malaya Le Leiden. She has Leiden. She has established a cafe at the hotel lobby as well. It seems like you have more service options to explore in the village now. Come visit when you have time. At this town, as this town's mayor, Lewis, has stated, a part of tourism revenue of Ridgeside goes to Pelican Town. Though to be honest, with how fast Ridgeside is developing, it may one day become an independent town. And I'm pretty sure those siblings are worrying about that. Lewis being envious and Lenny being afraid of more paperwork and responsibilities. Oh, how this valley still manages to be sustainable must be a miracle, especially being under those two. Alright, so the new mod I got is a walk of life or something like that. The problem is it doesn't seem to have worked, so I think I need to respect my skills. Also, this won't be fixed. Uh, that's something I read. I don't know if that's true or not, but there still is a map when we get to Ridgeside. And we know where Ridgeside is. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and take care of the farm and then I'll meet you guys back here. See you in a minute. All right, I'm back. And I do have some plans for today. So we're gonna go ahead and deal with that in just a moment. So give me just a sec. I should have waited to come back, but oh well, not that big of a deal. All right, so there's a couple things I can complete and I wanna complete them. First of all though, let's put these strawberries in here. Wow, there's some actual stuff in here. Strawberry wine, star fruit. Nice. And then got a lot of jams. All right. So ancient seeds. Going to turn them into some packs. And now one of the things we can do is, where is it? Iridium ore, 20 and coal. Wait, was it coal? Cool. So 20 and 20. Now this sucks. But we gotta do it. So there's that. I no longer need to save that. Alright. And then... Andy Cellar. Wood. I need to, I can collect wood easily. Hardwood. Stone and iron bars. Iron bars. I got enough. Now, for stone and hardwood and wood, I don't know if I have enough of that, but we can check real quick. I have enough stone, for sure, and I have enough hardwood if I get five more hardwood, so it's not too bad. I can easily get that. All right, so for now, we're going to go ahead and deliver this to Clint. I'll meet you guys at Clint's. All right, we're at Clint's. Let's go ahead and drop this stu stuff off. I don't know what this does, but... There's, I don't know why you needed iridium. Thank you for the three grand. All right. So the next thing I want to do is uh, this I think is a glitch. 
I'm not for sure. Uh, we can reset this. Bushes, trees, weeds, grass, twigs, rocks. I don't want. I don't care about forage. I hope this resets it here only. I don't know why what this is and why it's like this. That's weird. It did fix something. I, I don't know what that was, but it fixed it. Now here's hoping nothing got ruined at my farm. Alright, so there is something I need to do, and we need to stop by the sewer for it. I also missed Saturday's chance to buy an iridium sprinkler, which sucks. But, oh well. It's not that big of a deal. I can make them now. I, I can easily go get iridium. I say that, and I'll never find iridium ever again. Oh! Ooh! Sh a shadow person above ground. This is outrageous. Your people were responsible for the death of my entire family. You dwarves have hidden us from our ancestral home. We never had to, we've never had to resort to violence. I'm sorry about your family. Sorry isn't gonna cut it. Hell yeah, combat. Let me at him, he's despicable. Come and get it, shrimpy. Hell yeah, set him on fire. Silence, both of you! I got blue hair today. Nice, Mr. Wizard. The elemental wars have long been finished. You have no reason to be fighting any longer. The two of you must make peace for the sake of humans that live around you. Surely you can see that. Very well. I'll stay away from the sewer from now on. My voice suddenly changed too. And I'm truly sorry about the past, dwarf. I have no personal gripe with you. Very good. I shall cast a seal of promise to finalize this agreement. Yeah, but what if he wants- what if he decides he wants to be friends? And then now he can't visit the sewer ever. No, don't go back up. I need to stay down there. Come on. Thank you. Alright, we're coming here for this. Yeah, here's... Farming. Does it cost 10,000 for each one? Holy crap, my money. Holy crap, that's kind of stupid. There should be an all option and you get a discount. <laughs> All right, I'll meet you guys back at the farm. We got uh, things we're gonna be reset or re reset after we sleep. So give me just a moment to get back to the farm. I'm not going to sleep, no. All right, so we're back. There's a couple things I need to take care of. The first one being, I don't want this to actually be an opening. I'll show you why in just a minute. I'm also gonna get rid of this. So we're gonna cover this up. And then all right so we're gonna have to go to robin's to get that moved so i'll meet you guys at robin's and i'll see you soon all right we are here at robin's construct farm buildings move buildings and then we go down here A lot better. I like it at least. And then I got an idea for this. So let's go ahead and say that. And exit. I love how it snow shows the snow on the roofs whenever you're doing that. That's cool. All right. Hard to really see the horse, isn't it? Thank God for the hat and saddle. I'll meet you guys back at the farm. All right. I'm back. Look at this. I cleared it. Yay. Now I can add paths and stuff because that's what I want to do. It's almost episode 100. I really want to make my farm look really good before I show it off to you guys. I mean, you guys are already seeing it, but a little farm tour might be pretty fun, you know? Let's go ahead and clear the rest of these trees. Probably won't be able to get these. And maybe... Nope. It was a lost cause. 
Please fall to the left. Thank you. I wish I could add my own trees to places, you know, that'd be kind of cool. Alright, well that's taken care of. We got a hell of a lot of wood. So I can finish what I was wanting to do. Go ahead and do that, why don't we? I forgot my horse over there, didn't I? Crap. Oh well. Sure, it's fine. I got a piece of coal. I don't know why I got coal. Alright. Let's go over here. Put this coal in here. I'll be right back. Alright. So I'm back. Let's go ahead and complete this. And let's see. I think right here is fine. There, and then we'll do right here. Yeah, I think that's fine. We can't go under this, can we? No. Alright. And then we put the fence right here. And there we go. We got a little area down here. We can grow stuff down here too if we wanted, but I'm gonna make this into a little patio, so it's not gonna... That's not gonna be how that is. Now, I kind of been thinking, maybe I do want an exit over here too, and I'm thinking of putting that in later. I'm gonna see if I need any... If I do. Okay, I'm gonna do this real quick and I'll be right back. Alright. The gate is set. And then we can go ahead and head to bed and see if the... Walk of Life, I think it was called, actually works. Ooh, some good music. A little sad, but good music nonetheless. We have a baby, Kingler. Yes. And I get my farming. Ah, this just seems the same. Um, give me, give me a second. Give me a second. Alright, I think I just paid 10 grand for nothing because it's not working for me, so I don't know. But we're gonna pick... We're gonna pick this because I, I want animal crops to be worth more. You produce wool faster. You friend coop animals. This one. This one. 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 Alright. Yeah, I don't know. It's not... I don't think it's working for me. I did install it properly. So I don't know what's up with that. I'll have to check it out. But that was something I was gonna, you know, check out. And I paid 40 grand for it. Oh no. Anyways. Let's see the weather. Beautiful sunny day, of course. Mildly perturbed and living off the land. All right. Yeah, and it says it's you know it works for. It says it works for this, so I don't know. For a saved game, I mean. And there's nothing in here. Oh, I can go to mod options from here. I forgot about that. It says there is a menu for it. Baby needs to take off the horses, even better RNG. Yeah, I don't see it. That's odd. Alright, I'll have to look into it. I can feel it. You're gonna win the fishing contest today. Of course I am. Alright, we got some mail. What's this mail about? You don't have any Um... Pretty sure I did. However, I'm missing something in Iridium Bar. No, okay, I don't know. That was weird. <laughs> Alright. Let's go ahead and check in here real quick. Nah, nothing. I, I'm not picking the trees because I really don't, you know, care too much about that. Alright, so I'm going to take care of the farm animals and I'll be right back. All right, the farm animals has been taken care of. And now we got to go to the Festival of Ice. So give me just a moment. Put all this stuff in here. 
I was gonna deliver an iridium bar to the wizard, but that's not gonna happen today because I gotta go to that event. However, I can make some money because I do need to make some money, so. Go ahead and grab the stuff I can sell. Oh, I got a lot of blueberries to go through, holy crap. And then we'll head to the event. But first, honestly, I don't really need to do the event, but might as well. Look at all that money I'm going to make. Can't wait to see it. I don't think I bring my own fishing rod, but I'll bring it anyways, just in case. Always got to bring the best. All right. And down we go. All right, so the, I'm going to talk to everyone again, so just give me a moment real quick. All right, let's begin. I got here extra early this morning so I could get started on my sculpture right away. What do you think? It looks nice. Ooh, who are you? I got Lewis to equip the poles with these more humane hooks. It seems like a small thing, but I'm glad he listened. Good luck on the contest later. May the best fisher win, which is me, of course. Before you walk away. When I was younger, my father and I loved to fish together. Haven't fished at all since then. I think you'll do great in the contest, Kingler. I won last time, so. Remember to keep track of your temperature. If you ever feel unwell, don't hesitate to approach me, Philip, and Dr. Harvey. Anton. New person as well. Those ice sculptures look really good. Let me tell you, igloo building is not as easy as it looks. I don't know how the old hermit does it. At least the fishes are returning to the pond after the contest. We can't disturb the natural balance for sport. This festival is just a waste of time and resources. You spend a lot of time waiting for the fish. However, when you do catch one, they tell you to let it go at the end of the day. My grandfather would be sad if he knew that I wasn't entering the contest, as it was something we both love to do. But I just have a lot on my plate, and I don't have the patience right now to wait for the fish to bite the bait. We should be ready for this should be ready in an hour or two i hope there are some people who are still around to see it then mark my words i'd really more than anyone else you know you all know the one could die with hypothermia right right i just don't understand the point of all this the ice sculptures remind me of marble statues at the ballet theater back in the city i used to try to copy their poses when i was little have you ever noticed how willie and lewis can walk on the ice without slipping at all i wonder how they do that and of course we got the shop, frozen dreams, just blue painting, cranberry sauce, pumpkin stuff. Uh, I'm good. Why aren't you a marriage candidate? All right, let's go over here. There is someone walking over here. It's a what is this? This is new. Sneaking off to visit my weird tower. You're odd for a mundane. Wizard, what are you doing? Alright, let's continue down here and see if uh, there's that weird thing again. Alright. We live right across the street from a river. I'm amazed that I still don't know how to fish. Nah, this isn't too cold. Cold is when you go outside with wet hair and it freezes. Overheard Willie talking about you. It'll be a close match between you two. I'm helping the kids build a snowman. We need to find the perfect branches for arms. Well, you're not really looking that hard. I must say, I'm looking forward to seeing Willie show off his fishing skills. You can tell he's ta how talented he is. He's been fishing all his life. I want to build a snowman. Come on, let's make one, silly. Ah, oh, okay, after the fishing contest, then. Nicole, can never, Nicole never really bothered me. I'm more worried about my wife, who isn't really that fond of the season. Too cold. I should have brought more coats. Snowman's always, always make me laugh. Looking good, Kingler. Can't li can't lie, I love a cutie bunny. I want to go make a snowman too. The gleaming white snow is magical. Mmm, tonight will be nice. Sitting by a fire with hot chocolate snuggling up next to, um, I mean, just feeling snuggly. I already know, though. Like, brr, I should have bundled up more. The cold doesn't mesh well with these old bones of mine. I come for the ice fishing, just to watch, though. You never catch me out on the ice. Well, no one had hypothermia last year, so I guess I can lighten up a bit. What? Sorry, just daydreaming. I'm already crafting my plans for the Feast of the Winter Star. 
Why do the fish? Why do they fish in the winter? Why? Just why? That doesn't make any sense. Oh yeah, Clint. Um, I guess. Maybe I can be the snowman's aunt. Well, look at this, Emily. It's like the snowman's our own little kid. You're the mom and I'm the dad. <laughs> Dude, that's creepy. Hey, my daughter thinks she's the best angler in town. Ha! Huh? How can she forget where these je those jeans come from? That's a new person? Well, he taught me some fishing tricks a while back. I wonder if he'll be watching me to see if I remembered. Moose has always liked this festival more than I ever did, so I'll just sit back and let him run it. They released the fish after the festival. It'd just go bad if we didn't. Can you believe the borderline tropical will be around here in just a half a year? I know, it's interesting, isn't it? How nature works. Two words, pizza festival. Seriously, that needs to happen this year. It'd be so easy too. We just order a crap ton of pizzas from Gus and pass them around. Dang, my god, you're one of my favorite characters, dude. I actually practiced a little bit in preparation for the competition. Alright, well, I mean by that is, I didn't practice at all. You spot any force? You spot any force slimes? Alert me. We're deep in the forest. Anything can be out here in the woods. Hmm. Mr. Agar Aguar is staring intensely at the candy can. He really wants a candy can. Just, just find one, man. I'm sure they're everywhere here. Oh, Linus, always up by yourself. I traveled all over the place when I was younger. Some places are like this year-round. I don't think I can handle living in the tundra anymore. That was when I was younger. Linus, you do some amazing things still, and you're a really old man, so like, yeah. Believe in yourself more. Alright. The snow is hard to make into shapes. Dad says it's not wet enough. How can snow be not wet? Miss Penny, do you have a hat we can use? I keep trying to make snow wings for my snow penguin, and they keep falling off. Well, I mean, of course. Hmm, what kind of snowman should we make? How about something with peppermint candies for eyes? Look to Abigail for inspiration. Conventional one. It's only the true way to do it. When you only do it once or twice a year, the classic ones never get old, huh? I think next I'll try to eviscerate this snow goon's belly with some kind of creature crawling out. Maybe I can use a fish from the competition. Ew. Finally, I can spend some time outside and throw a snowball. Hmm, is there anyone I can hit? Or they'll just be mad, won't they? Nah, just throw it. I should look through my wardrobe for some winter fashions. I got some really- I've got some really cute fur coats that I've never even worn. Hey, I've got an idea. Maybe we could take some sports jerseys and have a snowman wear them. Actually, would a jersey even fit a snowman's body? Oh, they make my favorite athletes look all fat. Alright. Hey, Kingler, ready for some ice fishing? Yes, and I'm gonna beat you. We'll see. I understand why they do catch and release, but between you and me, I'd rather fry those fish up with some good seasoning the way I learned on Immer Island. Hey there, Kingler! Staying warm! My gloves have holes in them. I'm not bothered by the cold, so it's not that big of a deal. I wonder if Emily can teach me how to mend them. This time, I'm staying as far away from the holes as possible. You fall in last time. Sebastian makes some pretty cool snowmen. I feel like I could learn a thing or two from him, if he'd let me. Fishies, they're so cute. They could be made into really tasty food, too. Oh, Luna. Luna is one of my favorite characters, and I love the mod. I really haven't done much with Luna, but I will. I will. I'm, I need to get her friendship up a lot, and I don't think I have it up that well. At least I'm not for sure. I don't really talk to her much, which is pretty... Well, no, she's four stars, so that's not too bad. Four hearts, not stars. I wish my brother could join the competition. I think he would have a good time. He used to fish a lot. The ice sculptures are cool. I'll ask grandmother if I can have one for my birthday. I wonder what's going on in Yuma's head. He's been staring at the other kids for a while, but he insists on staying here. I hope Yuma's able to play a bit today. To be honest, that's really all I want. I like winter. It's peaceful. Oh, that's Kent. Okay. Or I should have worn an extra layer. Are you participating in the fishing competition? I actually think Abby Snowgoon is pretty funny. I love the forest when it's silent. When the snow falls off the branches, it makes that soft thump. I just love that. My god. Good luck! 
Remember to engage your core. Shoulder injuries are the worst. My joints be my joints will be stiff from the spending so much time in the cold, but the visit is worth it. Festival is very important to me, you know. I brought my extra heavy blanket for this. Almost done. Rumor has it there's a plethora of artifacts buried underneath this very soil we're standing on. I don't know what voice to use for him. Remember my advice. Stay on your toes, become one with the rod, you hear me? Don't tell Bert, but I dragged him out here because I know Trini wants to show him the snowman she'll build. Janice, that's a new person. We're gonna get a cup of hot coffee around here. I need to warm up. And Lorenzo, a new person. I don't know how to fish. I'd like to learn one day. That's everyone I talked to, right? And I'm still missing this person. But I've talked to everyone else. Uh, are you not around? I miss... Let me look for this person and I'll be right back. Yeah, she is not around. Okay. Let's win this ice competition. I don't, did I win last year? I'm not sure. I think I actually lost on this playthrough. Alright, everyone. Let's begin this year's ice fishing competition. King Lee, because you're the main character, you gotta start in the middle. The rules. Everyone else can start by the ponds. Kind of messed up. All right, we got this. We're almost max vision. Come on. Last time, I barely caught any fish. I think I did lose because I think what was going on was I was catching nothing but seaweed, and it kind of annoyed me. I think I got really annoyed at that. This time, it's different. I will win this time. Maybe. Please. You don't understand. Hell yeah. I wish they had a count so I can know them at all times. Come on. Fight. Fight. Any moment now. Of course it's seaweed. Oh, uh, this sucks. Really? I don't know what is about the ice fishing competition if a mod I have makes it a lot harder to do or something. But like, the seaweed or the algae chance for this is ridiculous. Like, what the hell? This is ne I have never caught that much algae while doing the- Oh my god! Alright, well I'm losing. I already know I'm losing. It might be me being a little salty about it, but come on. I'm level 8 fishing. I shouldn't be catching just algae. I might download a fishing overhaul mod. I lost. There's no way I won that. Oh boy. So I think I lost twice in a row. Right, two years in a row I lost. Yeah, yeah, just tell me I lose. Got three fish. Three. Five fish. Wow. That's ridiculous. I'll be honest with you, that is ridiculous. Five fish when all I was getting was algae. Like, what? What the hell? Oh, I should have just not wasted my time at this stupid contest. I didn't win the competition. No, it was not fun. I caught nothing but algae the whole time. And I had to throw the algae back. That makes sense. Alright, so enough of me being salty. I'm sorry. Just... And we have this song again. Wow. Alright, let's go to bed. I've had enough of the day. There we go, almost a hundred grand. Nice. Alright, so I'm gonna tell you this now. This will be the episode for Wednesday. 
episode 92.5 is the episode for Tuesday that had to be re-uploaded. An explosion was heard during the morning. That was a meteor? Not sure. The Animal Crossing and Terraria that I missed Tuesday and Animal Crossing I'm going to be... It, Animal Crossing will be out later today. Way later. After I get off of work at 12.30, I'll make it. And then I'm going to post Terraria as well because I missed it Tuesday. My work's been a mess, so everything's been crazy, and my upload schedule's been off the wall. So I'm sorry about that. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you so very much for watching, and I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye!